Hey, what's up, guys? Adrian here. So, welcome back. And I'm on the Mine United server again with me, Runic Titan. Yay. Okay, so, guys, we actually did a lot uh, today, or we're gonna do a lot today. Um, but first, I'm gonna show you what I did today. And as you can see, we have a road up here, and uh, I actually found another zombie spawn. And I guess what I did? I made the second mob trap, and um, this is where they will fall. And it works pretty well, you just need to stay here for a while. But uh, yeah, so that's just a quick update, I guess. And so what are we going to do today, hey John? Um, What we were thinking of doing is making a um, wheat farm, an automated one. Yep. And we've already excavated the, well, um, horror titan, runic titan, sorry, was doing the mob spawner. Um, I was digging up this room and ready for the automated wheat farm. So I think what's going to happen is the Rainy Titan is going to take the lead on building this thing because I'm still learning a little bit about Minecraft and how everything works. And what I do is I watch Runic because he's the best teacher to you know learn from, basically. <laughs> um. Okay, so I want to make this up here because I want to. I'm not totally sure, but I guess we'll just go for whatever comes out. Yeah. So this is just the wall where I'm gonna have have the redstone behind. Okay. So how do I do this? Um, so if the water, or actually we need one more white actually. So as you can see, this room is quite big. Um, I decided to go with really really long because of you know. It's gonna be more way, efficient. Can, yeah. Okay, so we have the pistons here. And what I was thinking of doing is, at the bottom of here, is having some chests so you can store your um, wheat in a chest instead of having to go out to another part of the room. Yeah, I think we might need some more dirt. I don't know. Okay, I'll go and grab you some. Yeah. Oh, damn. That's it. What the hell is that? Oh, Orcs is in the um, thing hitting me. Is he hitting you? Yeah, he's hitting me. He's pretending that he's a, a mob. Yeah, that's just kind of douchey. Um, whatever, ignore that. And how am I gonna activate this now? Okay. Okay, I've got you some more dirt as well. He's just asking for trouble, that guy. Yep. Okay, so here's some dirt. Nah, uh, some more dirt as well. Yeah, might not have in your just... space, but oh, whatever. <laughs> this is a little bit confusing, but I guess uh, I will do that. Um, it's just the way how I'm gonna power the pistons and have the water above uh, the redstone. That's what I'm just wondering about. Yeah. So I'll just remove this for now because I need to focus on the pistons. Yep. What I'm going to do quickly is I'm going to go and build some chests. I'm just going to put them down the bottom. Curious if this will work. Oh, it does. Okay, sweet. Didn't know that. Okay, so I've got my wood. Let's go and whack it in there. What about redstone? Does that work? Oh, it does. I didn't even know that. The more you learn. Yeah, I've got my three um, chests. Nice. So this isn't gonna take that long now that I've no learned this thing. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Gonna want one more um, chest. Yep. Or are you putting the signs on the chest, or...? Yeah, I will be. I, I will do that in a second, yeah. Yeah, because we might need, like, a... What is it called? Greenery? Is that what you call it? Greenery? Yeah, greenery stuff. For example, leaves uh, and flowers and that stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so... We just want that in there, like that. Okay, uh, where am I now? I just need to... Oh yeah. Oh yeah, bubba. 
Okay, as you can hear, the zombies are spawning like hell right now. <laughs> yeah. Could be a problem, but... Uh, what I want to do, guys, is I'm actually going to make... Uh, in the probably the next video, I'm going to make a light system so I can turn off and on the spawner um, thing. That way, we won't have to um, turn down the volume in Minecraft just because of the zombies. Yeah. Okay, we've got um, two chests, one for wheat items and one for seeds. Nice. Okay, so also what I'm going to do is I'm just going to... Okay, I need to mine this out a little bit and move the redstone a little bit this way. Hopefully the redstone will reach all the way here. So if I have the button here, um, actually the lever, I need to make a lever. Okay, so just one that. Hola Okay, I need to make a stick. There you go. My inventory is all full. Wow. Okay, guys. So if you didn't know how to build a automated wheat farm, as you, as you can see, that um, Runic Titans made a like a, a thing at the back, mm. an entrance. So the redstone is behind, so you don't actually see the redstone or anything because you want it hidden. Um, you don't want to see any of that. And then, as you can see, that these pistons will come up and there'll be water behind. Yeah, I just somewhere. need to make one more of these uh, repeaters. Yep. <laughs> Them too. It sounds like he's speaking to an item. I don't know. Right. Uh, the zombies are getting loud. Yeah. We'll have to kill them later. Okay, so to make a redstone repeater, I need to put three stones there. Two redstone, and... We're gonna need a lot more dirt. A lot more of it. Yeah, I do have a lot of dirt, so... It's got, I've got three stacks, so that's probably fine. Okay, because we're gonna need to obviously build. <clears throat> How are we gonna do this? Are we going to dig one down into the cobblestone and then put a layer down there so it's obviously, you know, so that the water can travel? Um, yeah, what I'm going to do... Actually... Actually... Hmm. Maybe what I was thinking is we can make... I don't know, let's just see what it's like. Uh, now I think I found a problem here that I didn't think of. I go and do that. I'm just going to show you guys what... You know, so <clears throat> what so far we've got. So in this, we've got you know. Um, that works. Never mind. Got the zombies are making a lot of noise. Miscellaneous um, stuff. Uh, in this one, we've got you know all wood items. Oh fuck. This one in here, we've got gold, but obviously we haven't got enough gold at the moment. Um, this one here, we've got all cobblestone, as you can see, furnace and stone bricks and cobblestone. This one here, we've got coal. We've got quite a few stacks of coal. Um, and this one here we've got iron, quite a few bits of iron. And then this one here we've got gravel items as well, so yeah. And then this side here, as you saw in the uh, yesterday's video, that I actually had um, all the furnaces stacked up and there you can see. Um, some of them have already got iron oh, in them. fuck. I'm so stupid. And there you are. So just whack. Them into there. There's 62 bits of iron and gut, so we're not going to be about iron. And also, we are going on a few adventure runs just to grab enough resources to so we can, you know, survive and stuff like that. Yep. And uh, hopefully, what's going to happen is we will be going on a, a few diamond hunts to look for diamonds. Um, because diamonds are, you know, good. Yeah, really good. Pretty awesome. Yeah. There we go. Now we should be good in a second. Just need to make the water sources. We should be good to go. Okay. So. Uh, if you make a hole, real quick. Yeah. 
then we okay okay uh. okay put the water source here yeah I've got a hoe here my mouse is starting to die on me in a moment <laughs> I'm waiting for my new mouse to come through um I think I've talked about it on the last video uh, called Raptor. Oh yeah. If you don't know anything about it, it's raptor.com. And what it's all about is that basically you sign up to this place called uh, this website called raptor.com. And what it is, um, every time you play a game like Minecraft, it you know every time you rack up a few hours, you get entered into prize draws. And those prize draws consist of like you know. Modern Warfare 3 mouses, Modern Warfare 3 keyboards, and stuff like that. Now, the Modern Warfare 3 mouse retails from 149 UK pounds. Now, I've got the Modern Warfare 3 mouse and the keyboard together for 25 pounds. Now, all that together would cost 250 pounds altogether. And you might be wondering, oh, that's a ripoff. How you know it's a it's a scam? Well, it, not really. What it is all about? I've built this wrong. Um, what it's all about is that you know Logitech are in partnership with Raptor, and um, you know they sponsor Logitech, and that's how they get their custom customers. Sorry, and it works both ways. So I mean, go and have a look at it out, check it out. I mean, I've already ordered my uh, Logitech mouse and keyboard, and I'm just waiting for it to come through the post because this keyboard I've got and the mouse they're just breaking and they're, they're not really working at the moment at this right time. So. Hmm. So yeah, basically Adrian is proof that the system works, the Raptor system. Okay, here we go. And that's how you make a automated w seed farm. See all the seeds? Seed in a wheat farm, yay! There yeah. we go, that seems to work wheat pretty farm, nice. Not seed farm. Yeah. So I think that's about it, done for us. Yeah, and we As will you, both uh, see you guys. Weeds. Yeah. So if you want want anything else built or you know you want to see us do something else, please message us in the comment section below. Until then, guys, you've been listening to AGN and we'll speak soon. Yeah, and for my subscribers, uh... oh damn, I just I just stopped it. <laughs> yeah, for my subscribers, we'll speak soon too.